Hi, I'm Mona. This is Sacred Geometry Universe Video Journal Diary for um, October 22nd, 2022. So, October 22nd, 2022. Nothing too special about those numbers. I don't know why I was thinking that. Anyways, um, so yeah, so we have a new plan. <laughs> It always happens like that, you know, just stuff switches up. <clears throat> so I've been doing like the readings and stuff. I mean, I haven't been doing the readings and stuff because I'm at a place where you have to pay to get in. And I, you know, I don't want pe people to waste their money for a reading, whatever. And um, I was gonna go um, either to the other spot here, but there's no data and that kind of sucks. I don't mind it sometimes, right? Um, I don't have data right now, uh, so we haven't had data for a week. So basically, radio, I listen to the radio, radio works. Um, <clears throat> but I seen my friend Jason, uh, I, I knew he was going to come around here anyways. And so he showed up and uh, I went down to go see him where he was at. And you know, I just chatted up with him for a little bit. And then he told me that he was going to another spot next. It's called like Gooseneck Park or something like that, you know, and I guess it's a big, pretty big place. And I never been there. It's like an hour from here. Um, it's backtracking a little bit, but that's okay. Um, as long as it's, you know, right around here, it's, it's, it's fine. But that's a state park. They don't give too many discounts here at the state parks that I know of. Like they only let me have my days for free with the veteran discount but you know what when i go there i'm gonna go to inside the office and ask them because i don't know state parks usually give disabled uh discounts but i don't know we'll see um <clears throat> but if not it's okay you know because we're still go we're gonna go from monday to friday over there me and the doggies have decided to go there the reason why is well, that dude is cool, number one, <clears throat> and he knows how to fish really good, and he's got all these contraptions, and I'm kind of interested in seeing what he's going to do with those. He also has, like, a crab box or um, a cage, and so I, I kind of want to see what that's all about, too. So just to see what's what's there, you know, and, and maybe if, if need to, we can use my uh, Bayou Classic pot boiling thing boil some I don't know we'll see I don't even know what's there but the one thing I do know that's there that it's like a half and half place so half of it is by the water and half of it is like in the forest and so when I heard that part because I kind of like foresty I, I mean I like beach yeah I like beach I really really do but um at the state parks, foresty is nice because I can walk the doggies. There's lots of places to walk around. And if there's not trails, at least there's a lot of driveways, you know, looking at other campers and their dogs and the dogs get excited, whatever, you know. So I, I kind of like that. And, and since I haven't been there, I can make a video. I think that's why, you know, that's probably why I was like, well, maybe I'll do readings because I haven't been... I haven't been going to any new places. I've been just going to the same places that I already have videos for. Why make another video for it, you know? Plus this next place, I do, I still haven't finished the one video that I was going to make about the Louisiana State Parks. And so that'll give me an opportunity to work on that over there. Um, so then I'll have that video to put out and then I'll have a video for that place actually. And then from there, I want to come back to Padre Island. I want to see if my little family friends are here. Because, uh, yeah, you know, I'm seeing some people that I know around here. And uh, I want to see, because that's around Halloween. And I don't know what they do for Halloween. And maybe I want to get uh, the kids some candy. I don't know. I don't know what they do. I don't want to uh, uh, interrupt whatever they got going on with the kids, you know, because sometimes some parents, they don't do that. Me, I'm not really a holiday kind of person, but um, I don't know. We'll see what happens there. Uh, because over there, let's see, 24, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. So we leave there on the 28th. And then I want to come back here, uh, maybe Padre Island. Or I don't know. I'm going to see what's around there. I, I don't know if, 
No, because I was thinking, so Magnolia Beach is two hours from here. So it's, it's like the midpoint, um, which is cool because now I know about a place that's in the middle, you know, and it's a place that, you know, they have electricity and showers and all that stuff. So, you know, and that's nice to have sometimes, especially like the electricity. I don't have to use my, you know, my batteries or my solar or whatever, you know? <clears throat> so that's the new plan and we're going to stay there till Friday and then we're going to come back, uh, here probably to Padre Island and camp up there for another week. And, uh, you know, I don't know if I'm going to do the reading things anymore. People are too frightened by the tarot or they're like weird about it. They're like, Oh, like they'll message me and tell me stuff like, Oh, you need to read the Bible. You need, and dude, man, that's all I read. I read stuff like that all the time. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, people are so, I don't know. And, and, you know, I don't like dealing with that because it gives me bad vibes. Mm -hmm. Like I get there like negative. It's, it's violent too, the way they are, these Bible people who, you know, when they come at you, they're like, ah, you know, it's like, damn, you know, aren't you supposed to be kind and loving it? But they're not, they're like crazy. Like, and that's not, that's not, <laughs> it doesn't look positive for the people who read Bibles, not to me anyways. Um, but I read all kinds of uh, stuff from other um, cultures also, other countries, whatever. So, you know, for people to just jump in and say, that's so stupid. You don't even know who that person is or what they're studying or what they even do, you know? So I'm going to hold off on that. I'm still going to do readings for the channel, though, because I do enjoy doing those on the side. Like when I'm bored and stuff, I'm like, you know what, maybe I'll do a reading, you know? And, um, or sometimes I'll be walking the dogs and I'll be thinking, oh, I'm going to go back. I think I'm going to do a reading. Like maybe I feel like I need to do one, right? Um, I, I am getting the Zodiacs out. Uh, those will be done pretty soon here. I think I have two more left. Uh, but I also do the other ones because, you know, as I clean, it's like I find cards because I <laughs> stuff cards in places because I, I don't have them in just one place because that box filled up already. So I have to, I have, I have to figure out a new, pr I wish I could find another box like the one I have for the, the cards that are in there. It's like a stack on step box that someone gave me. I wish I knew where that, that person got that. Cause I would like another one so I could start putting the other, putting more cards. Cause I bought also another deck of cards. Um, I think it's called be kind. Yeah. I'm, probably that's the mood I was in. Like people need to just start being more kind, you know, like damn, you know, um, but over here, it's been okay. You know, it's, it's just like the online gosh, you know? So I think I'm going to hold off on, on putting out any, uh, some ladies did, me uh, message me about, they wanted a reading, but I was already done. I already left. And cause you know, some of the, the groups that I posted in, they, they have, a, you have to be approved your posts. All the posts have to be approved. So by the time they approved it, it was already over. So that's not my fault. You know, <clears throat> uh, for other, uh, groups, they approved it right away. So, you know, it was just hit and miss. And I, and I don't want to deal with them. I'm tired of that. I'd rather just do like I've been doing mention to people that I'm a reader. And if they want to read, they can just have one right there. You know, that seemed to work out a lot better than trying to advertise and, and weirdos, weirdos, you know, some people nice. So, some people nice, but, but some are weirdos, you know, like, and, um, so anyways, uh, so that's what I think I'm going to do with that. And, uh, just focus some more on, um, the readings. Um, and, and also I think I'm going to, um, I'm going to come back to Padre Island, but then next I'm going to look for another new spot. Like I want to try to, I think what, as I move along, I'm going to try to go to places I haven't been. You know, even though it's familiar, whatever, you know, um, I just want to go to places uh, so I can make a new video for, you know, the places playlist because, you know, uh, people seem to like those. So, I mean, and I'm cool with doing them. It's really fun to make them, too, because I get to explore and go around and take cool pictures of the dogs and, and you know, look at, look at who's on the bed behind me right now. Chica's there. Every morning I let her come up, not at night, because she's too big, man. She takes up all the space. 
uh, Brian gets up there, but he goes up there just to be a dick. You know, he goes up there to be like, ha ha, I'm up here and you're not for Chica, right? But then like a, a moment later, he gets down anyway. So um, he's really rude like that. He likes to be like, he likes to throw, throw it in her face or something, whatever he's trying to do, the jealousy thing. He, and you know, he'll find a stick on the beach and he'll just run away with it. And, you know, in front of her and, and she'll want to play and he won't let, you know, he really is, you know, but he's had to wear the muzzle because he's been barking and she hasn't. So, you know, there's some things that. You know, she's a good dog and she listens. She really does. I just have to figure out how to, um, the bark. If she could, if she would only understand that if she didn't bark and she just chilled out right there, people would approach and want to pet her. It's when she starts barking, but basically I think what she's doing is she's telling people, Hey, I'm cute too. Pet me too. Because everybody wants to pet Brian, you know, um, but she looks so ferocious, just like uh, I have a friend, she lives in Illinois, and um, she, when I first met her, she had a little fluffy black dog, you know, but now the dog is big, and it's it seems ferocious, and it was even like that, she she had a little bit of fear too, but I, I'm t I, was, I told her, I said, no, your dog wants to play, your dog, I don't... I don't know how I get these dogs so quickly when it comes to that part. You know, some stuff I know, like, ooh, because, but that dog wanted to play. I was like, watch, I'll show you. And, you know, and I showed her with Brian because Brian's happy go lucky, whatever. If a dog will overpower him, he will just get away. So, um, and I didn't, I didn't have Chica. And so, um, yeah, put them together and they were playing, you know, so, so that, that eased her up on a little bit. And it also eased me up a little bit from doing, from when I got her, because I remembered about her and her dog. And I'm like, you know what? Yeah. Chica's just a black dog with white, big white teeth, you know, it just gotta, and it's, and it's true, you know, so like she'll start barking at other dogs and, and, and I can't tell she's saying, Hey, come pet me or, or I, you know what it is, is I don't, I, I gotta take her to uh, dog parks and just see what happens because she'll be with dogs more her size. They usually separate small dogs from the big dogs, you know, and um, I always go into the big dog side anyways, because Brian's crazy. Um, I gotta take her to some more of those so she can kind of because I hate having that Nick thing on her when she starts getting crazy when other dogs are passing. I gotta jerk it a little bit and I know it hurts, but she stops, you know, my friend, he told me about a uh, neck thing that he had that works off the vibration of the bark. I might even consider something like that, you know, cause I really hate, uh, having to tug on her with that middle, you know, Brian has one too, though. They had to, he had to learn off that too. So we'll see. Um, so yeah, that's all I have. Uh, and that's, those are the plans of what we're going to do. So I'll have like a new video of a new place to go to, uh, which will be fun. That'll be next. And then I'm going to see maybe, you know, cause I haven't been around that area maybe there'll be, no, no, actually that's right. I'm going to come back to Padre Island. And then when I get to Padre Island, I will uh, figure where we're going to go after that because we'll probably stay a week, uh, over there by that time. Anyways, we could stay uh, two weeks if we wanted to. But, you know, I just, I get so, bo I get so bored at, at some places. I want to already see us a, a new spot, you know, like, like I was telling my, uh, my friend Jason the other day, I was like, yeah, you know, uh, some of these places, cause he's like, oh, you can come park here, maybe stay for a month. And maybe for people who, who, who aren't like traveling, like that would be appealing to stay somewhere, somewhere free for a month. But dude, for me, 14 days is more than enough. By, by the time like the 10th day comes around, I'm already like, how many days have we been here already? Like I'm ready to go already. You know what I'm saying? So it just depends for everybody, you know, Chica, she's a good girl. She's a, she likes it up here. It's because it's, it's a nice big comfy bed. I didn't put it up yet. Uh, it's, it's morning. I'm, I'm having my coffee right now. So yeah, uh, I was thinking about having some pancakes. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. I haven't had pancakes for a while. Um, but yeah, that's all I have. And, um, th those are the plans and 
This is Sneak Geometry University Journal Diary for October 22nd, 2022. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!